before I even get to asking Dr. Komar how is they going to give a cop extra. What the fuck going on in Houston, Texas, man? Every time I look, man, there's always some shit going on down there, man. Y'all got all these goddamn guns and shit just... Then y'all take the shit to Joel Osteen. Y'all know Joel Osteen, man. The white dude. We're going to turn now to new information about that deadly shooting at Joel Osteen's mega church in Houston. We're seeing new video showing the chaos Sunday as the shots rang out. Police say the shooter was a 36-year-old woman with a history of mental illness. It's Palestine, man. Palestine! Ah! <laughs> Investigators are sifting through chilling new videos like this, showing panicked churchgoers in one of the country's largest houses of worship. Dr. Colmar, how you feeling over there, man? How is going on, man? How we feel? I'm good, man. I don't, I don't know what's going on with these people, man. They up here talking about this, you know, Illuminati and, you know, ice, ice spice, and it got something to do with all that bullshit. Ah, you know, whatever. Super Bowl hey, man. Stuff and whatever, the, whatever. When it comes to Super Bowl. We have a situation that's going on in Houston, Texas. And that situation is a lady. What the fuck is her name? Walked into the megachurch. Yep. Genesee Ivan Moreno. And Houston, Texas decided to take her free time on this planet before she got deleted, goddammit, by an off-duty police officer who was in the megachurch. Working security, she opened fire. Joel, no. Joel, bull, no. you know what I'm saying, man? Carrying an AR-style rifle when she was... Gracefully, she injured a child, injured an adult, and my man, who was off-duty, took her out. Yo, what the fuck going on in tech? What's, what's going on in your backyard, Dr. Komar, man? They were repetitive. Boom, 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 boom. The sound sent the congregation scrambling as security returned fire, killing the shooter. You know how many stories we've been covering so far is in Texas, man? I ain't seen one come out of Wisconsin yet. There's nothing crazy like this. I'm starting to think Texas is a new Florida, bro. And you know, we we like to we 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 like to carry them things, man. You know, I don't know what's going on, man. I I think the um the axis on the the world is spinning, man. You know, they they say the man is is coming. He coming and the aliens is coming down. And you know, the world is just off his axis, bro. I don't know what the hell is going on, but. He went in there and, you know. For them, the number of casualties and victims would have been much higher. She had to probably have the specs for Call of Duty, man, because she had a thing tatted up on her. And, you know, I don't know if she had her levels up there right because she couldn't she couldn't get nobody. You know, all jokes aside, you know, she, she went on the right level. She was probably at level two or level one. She didn't have the right gun. Hello. I left. I left. I left, bro. I left. I left, bro. I, 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 no, 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 no. I left, bro. I left. No, no, like, there's no fucking way. There's actually no way that that's even allowed in the fucking game. Wait, 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 bro. Are you saying she didn't have the right loadout? She didn't have the right loadout, bro. <laughs> she didn't have a rollout. Out. She, she went in there with a combat knife, man. And a or something. I don't know, man. Yo. The shooter's son appeared to be caught in the crossfire. The boy remains hospitalized in critical condition. Obviously, the off-duty cop had the right loadout. He hey, got her ass. Yo. Bing. Yo, I, I know, bro. Hey, look, man. You know that Call of Duty clip going in somewhere, man. But God, <laughs> everywhere it go, bro. Everybody getting shot. They getting shot, Dr. Komar. What the fuck is going on, especially in Texas? What Do you think it's some no form of the Kool-Aid? You know what I'm saying? The Kool-Aid man infecting the folks, man. What wow, you know, from the other side, that's kind of annoying. What's going on, bro? You don't drink Kool-Aid down here, man. It's, we drink whiskey or something like that, man. It's got to be the snow cones. We drink a lot of... It's the barbecue, man. It's got to be the barbecue down here in Texas. It's got to be the barbecue. What? Bro, what are you talking about? The world is off its hinges, bro. We need to we need to literally put it back. Everybody needs some yoga in their life. We need, to, we need to meditate, hug somebody, love somebody, and say, hey, let's not do this anymore. We're all the same... DNA, but they ain't not 96 can't remember this shit. Whatever. We're all Stay about the same. Stay in school, kids. Yeah. We all about the same DNA, so let's figure it out. And they said school wasn't important. But in retrospect, man, hey, listen, bro. Brother, excuse me, I'm getting a little too. We know we love to kick this shit on the internet network, man. We try to bring y'all a little bit more excitement, give y'all the, the compassion y'all want from the from the from the view of the viewers. But real shit, this is why we always stress about mental health. Because in reality, bro, in reality, who the fuck is writing free Palestine on a gun 
and running in the church, bro, and with the AR-15. And then, bro, then, bro, then, it's not funny, bro. But hey, look, hey, look, how you run in with the AR-15 and get killed with the nine, bro? That's like playing Call of Duty when you first play Warzone. They give you the pistol. Somebody find the AR, bro, and you still got the pistol and you get smoked, bro. That is dumb, bro. She had the wrong loadout. I'm bro. telling you, bro. she didn't know how to use it, bro. She was one of them. She was one of them new <laughs> players, bro. But in closure, man, mental health is very important, man. So when you try to count them dollars, man, count the cents in your brain, please. And hey, you heard, you heard, brother Comar said pistola. That boy learned that Spanish, man. Y'all make sure y'all put that in the comments, man. Y'all appreciate it, better a brother trying to learn a little language, man. Don't stop learning, man. Don't stop learning, man. We we still got some other shit to talk about, but anti network. A 57-year-old man who was also struck has been released from the hospital. While investigators zero in on a motive, they revealed yesterday one of the shooter's guns had a sticker reading Palestine on it. They also found anti-Semitic writings, but say they believe these may be related to a dispute with her ex-husband's family. There was a f familial dispute, and some of those individuals are, of, uh, are Jewish. Officials said the shooter has a history of mental illness and was arrested at least six times, including a weapons charge. Our CBS affiliate, KHOU, spoke to the shooter's mother-in-law, who says there were so many warning signs. She was violent many times. We've asked for help from police and received it many times, but she was still allowed to own guns. For CBS Mornings, Omar Villafranca in Texas.